Ten years later. How many? How many what? <laughs> Steps you walk. Uh, Hello, sir. Hello. Thank you. Thank you. Bye, uh, bye, bye. Seventeen times seven. Seventeen times seven. Yeah. It's a record, no? Record. Yeah. For you, yeah. Yeah. So we had man, yes, man walking. Seventeen There was only one lift, so. It's a lot of record. <laughs> and the lift was going up, so he had yeah. to walk down. He, he was okay. It was his idea. Yeah. I was, I was like, let's wait, but he's like, okay. Yeah. We're going to the cinema. Going to the Galaxy 2, I'm excited. And there goes our bus. We just missed a bus. Good start to the day there. We missed it. Ooh, 191 just left. Ah. Yeah, we missed it. Ooh, then what are you going to do? Um, wait, let me check. There is another one. Yeah, yes, yeah. lads. On our way. Yeah, yeah. You excited? You look like a different man, no? <laughs> no, you're the same man there. Same man, okay. Yeah. Is that a camera? Mm -hmm. Is that a camera? Yeah, no? That's, that's, clever, right? yeah. that's clever. That's clever of you. Yeah. I think so, yeah. yeah. This, this bus driver's high. He, he opened the door, right? Then it closed straight away. It nearly hit someone in the face. Ooh. It nearly hit her in the face. That man? No, that woman, she moved forward, yeah. then the doors closed. Yeah. It would nearly hit her nose. What a dodgy, what a dodgy bus, dodgy bus driver. Anyway, we're at the cinema. This time, we're a bit early, so we don't have to rush in. For previous day, we were a bit late, so we went in straight away, but we got some time, so. Got our tickets <laughs> going in. Glasses. See after the film. Well, that was fun. Yeah, wonderful. Eight out of ten for you. I think out of ten. Yeah. I think it's, uh, I can give uh, nine. Nine. Yeah. I give an eight. Give an eight. And I, I, it was really fun. It was really good. Yes. As I was saying, uh, Granddad's taking the bus. I think he's on that bus. Just gone past me. But yeah, I'm taking the train because it's cheaper. So yeah, Granddad's going straight home. I am going straight home on a train, which is uh, a lot quicker. The bus is more than half an hour, and the train is hot five minutes, and the train is cheaper as well. So, for him, everything is free anyway, so for him, it's okay. He can take anything, but because he couldn't walk, we couldn't take the, we couldn't take the train, but for me, it costs more to take the bus, so I took the train. Anyway, um, as I was saying, that was a fun movie. Really enjoyed it. Um, what I can say is it's not as good as the first Guardians of the Galaxy. The first Guardians of the Galaxy was probably the best Marvel film since the universe started in 2008. So uh, yeah, um, but but it was still it was still pretty good. I enjoyed it. It was really fun. Um, a lot of comedy. A lot of comedy. Probably the most comedy I've ever put in a, in a Marvel movie. But they're put in the right places, and it is really funny. The humor in this is really funny. The action's cool, as always in a Marvel film, but yeah, the plot-wise, plot-wise is pretty good, plot-wise is pretty good. Nothing amazing, but uh, it was pretty good. It was pretty emotional as well, at many times. Why? Well, watch it to find out. I'll do a spoiler video. Um, I'll do a spoiler talk video at some point, but yeah, this is my non-spoiler review. Really enjoyed it. Quite a lot of comedy. Uh, decent plot, great action. And yeah, loved it, 8 out of 10. On my way home now, you see that building there behind me? That's a surgery, I went, I went there every day for like 3 weeks. I had my operation because I had to have uh, treatment every single day. I had to see a nurse every single day. The first week of it was very painful. And yeah, I'm glad I don't have to go back there again because I'm fully recovered now. So uh, that's that's good news. What a difference a month makes, eh? It's over a month now since then, but yeah. Jurassic Prey? Is this like a ripoff of Jurassic Park? It looks pretty cool from that dinosaur. <laughs> this looks pretty... 
I might check this out at some point. I won't, I won't buy the DVD, but I'll check it out somewhere. But that looks that looks fine. Oh, why well, have never heard of one of these? I've heard of that. Hey, we've got the rest of the Marvel stuff. Avengers Assemble was brilliant. So is Winter Soldier and the first Guardians of the Galaxy. All there. BBS. There's a Lego version of Jurassic World. A Lego version. Wow. Never heard of this either. That's pretty funny. It's probably, it's probably a parody. Probably the same thing, just in Lego. Thomas and Friends. Extraordinary Engines. What is that? What? I've never seen that. Is that a new character? This was a lot of my childhood. I don't remember these new characters. Is that Fat Controller? Wow. At least it looks the same. I'm considering getting a special edition of this. Get this and COD 4 Remastered. I might get it because I love COD 4. It might be worth the money. I'm not sure. Well, it's not here though. It's probably on Amazon. You can get a phone for a fiver here, lads. And for tenner. Quite cheap. 20 quid there as well. 108 for that. A uh, bit more. 11 pounds. Here's where you get budget phones, lads. <laughs> As the price. 120 quid. I'm guessing this is quite a good phone. 50 quid. That's, a, that's on sale as well. Turn up. Yeah, it's a flip phone. Some pretty cool headphones here, not too expensive, but if there's any noise cancelling ones here, I'd consider getting one, but they're not here. Because Vincent had some really good ones. But there's none here, so never mind. So yeah, just a little recap walking away this time because it's Saturday and it's very busy everywhere because so because because it's so loud, I can't just talk because you won't hear me. But um, anyway, as I was saying, Guardians of the Galaxy Volume Two, it was fun. It was a great time to watch. It was hilarious. Um, there was a lot of people there as well, so. Every time there was something funny, there was laughter everywhere, which is great. I, I love a great atmosphere, so yeah, I really enjoyed it. It was really funny. Plot was pretty good. Not not an amazing plot, but pretty good. And as a whole, it was a good movie. A solid good movie. Nothing amazing. Not as good as the previous Guardians of the Galaxy movie, but still a good movie. Still, still a good movie. And one part of it certainly hits you emotionally. <laughs> one part of it. And um, Drax, Batista man, he's so funny as Drax. Um, they're all funny in a way, but yeah, Batista just, him and Groot, they steal the show for a lot of the time. And Yondu's great, Rocket Raccoon is great. Yeah, all, all the characters, all the main characters really, all the main characters in the movie are really great. But yeah, there's one, there's one really emotional bit, which will hit you. You'll know when you see it. But um, yeah, 8 out of 10, really enjoyed it. Where would I rank it though? Where would I rank it? Well, there's been 15 Marvel movies now. So I'd put Guardians, the first Guardians first, then Winter Soldier, then Civil War, then Avengers Assemble, then it's between Doctor Strange and Iron Man, the first Iron Man, and then after Iron Man Doctor Strange I'd say Guardians 2, and then Ant-Man, so I've named what, like 8 films now out of 15, I'm not sure about the rest of the list, but I've named, so, so, okay, why's the lighting in here? I look blue here, wow. Anyway, First Guardians, Winter Soldier, Civil War, Avengers Assemble, then it's between Iron Man and Doctor Strange, so those two next, six. Guardians 2, seventh, Ant-Man, eighth. That's how I'd rank my movies. That's not all 15, but the eight, the eight I've named were the, were the good movies. There were seven, the other seven are either average or not, they're just not that good. Like, Iron Man 3 was awful, Iron Man 2 was average. First Captain America, I guess, was okay. I'd put that probably after Ant-Man. But, uh, yeah. Um, the eight I named were the good movies of Marvel. And Guardians 2, I'd definitely put it up there. But, yeah, it wasn't as good It wasn't as good as the best Marvel movies, you know? Like, Winter Soldier and Guardians of the Galaxy, the first one. Those were amazing, you know? So, yeah, it's, it's, it's hard to uh, picture it. But this is, this is just considering the Marvel Studios, yeah? It's not considering X-Men and Logan and stuff. That's a different universe. I'm not considering those. I'm just considering the MCU. Okay, so don't get offended if I don't mention Logan. Or Spider-Man. They're old Spider-Mans. They're not MCU, so don't mention those. Uh, yeah, anyway, speaking of Spider-Man, there's one coming in July, which is MCU. And so is uh, Thor Ragnarok in November, so that'll be fun. Anyway, it is time to do an unboxing. I have these two and a box in the living room. Let's do this first. First of all, like, the Guardians movie, right? After the movie, Everyone, you can tell everyone enjoyed it because they were laughing the whole way through and 
they were just talking about it constantly after the movie. It's great to see that, you know, when a lot of people enjoy the movie that much. Marvel have a good track record, so I'm not surprised they did pretty well. By the way, there's five after credit scenes. Five. So there's two at the beginning of the credits, then there's a bit more credits, then the third one, a bit more credits, the fourth one, then the rest of the credits, the last uh, after credits scene. Um, two, of them, two of them are serious, other three are comedy, but they're still funny, you know, so check them out. Make sure you stick till the very end, because uh, I think the scenes are worth seeing. You buy one t-shirt for £22, get the other one for, the other one for a fiver. They, they sell all the t-shirts for like £22, all of them, and... They said buy one, get another one for five, so I thought, why not? So I got an AJ Styles one. Brilliant wrestler. Here it is. Here it is. There you go, AJ Styles. They don't want none! This was the one I got for a fiver, which is usually like £22. This is... Y2J's t-shirt. You just made the list! This is going to be very useful in my Spassius of the Week series because I have a list of Davidoff in that, and there's a list of Jericho t-shirts, so you just made the list, this is going to be really useful in my Spastics of the Week, Spastics of the Week video, sorry I keep mispronouncing, Spastics of the Week, I should be able to say that fast without stuttering, Spastics of the Week, anyway, it says the list of Jericho on the back, just pretend it says Davidoff, I bought this because it, because it looked cool, okay, I bought these, these were not on offer, they just look really cool, so I thought, you know what, let me get some of this, AJ Styles gloves. They look so cool. They actually, they look so, so cool. They'll keep me warm as well, so it's a win-win. It's, it's they look cool. They'll keep me warm. And it's someone I'm a big fan of. I'm a big fan of AJ Styles. He's, he's really good. He's one of the best around. Oh, yes. So now we have got a big box. Yeah. Obviously, I'm not, it's, it's not a box. I mean, it is a box, but the thing's in the box. Let me just open this. The next film I'm seeing with, with my granddad is uh, Wonder Woman. Comes out June the 2nd, my mom's birthday as well. So yeah, Wonder Woman, the next movie I'm watching my granddad's, and then Transformers at the end of June. Also, The Wall, Pirates of the Caribbean 5, and Baywatch all come out before Wonder Woman as well. So I'm going to watch all of those as well, just not my granddad because he's not into those type of, type of movies. So I'm watching those anyway. But with my granddad will be Wonder Woman, but before that I'm watching The Wall, Pirates 5 and Baywatch. I got a full list of 2017 movies I want to see. It's quite a long list. I just, now what I've seen so far, John Wick 2, Lego Batman, Logan, Kong Skull Island, Power Rangers, Furious 8, Guardians 2. So next we've got The Wall, the Pirates, Pirates of the Caribbean 5, Baywatch, Wonder Woman, Captain Underpants, Cars 3, Transformers 5, Despicable Me 3, Spider-Man Homecoming, War for the Planet of the Apes, um, Dunkirk, The Emoji Movie, Kingsman 2, Thor 3, The Justice League, Star Wars Episode 8, and Jumanji. This was completely for banter, but McDonald's did do an offer. So, I bought slippers. Just some funny ones. Some funny... Monkeyish slippers. So, uh, I just hope that they're comfortable, so I'm gonna find that out right now. Earth to Davidoff! Are these comfortable? Can you walk around in these? Yes, they are. They're pretty comfortable. Yeah. I, I could make a bit of a noise. That's the slippers. So, that, that, that's a bit of a concerning noise there. A bit of a concerning noise, but... It's a bit annoying, but it is comfortable, so this will be useful. My, my mum always complains at me because I always walk around barefoot. So she's like, get slippers, get slippers. So I got some slippers. I had these ones before, but they are dirty. And uh, yeah. Do you want to know how lazy I am? This camera is still on the tripod. Okay, on the tripod. That's how lazy I am, okay? There's a mess behind this camera as well. I need to clean up. So I can have more space in the tripod. Anyway, um, one more parcel. Let's do it. By the way, it's been a really good week so far. So hopefully it caps off a perfect week if Arsenal beat Tottenham. Which, well, who knows. Hopefully we do. This video will be up before that match. But if you're watching after that match, then uh, if we won, then yes lads, we won. If we lost, then, oh no, season's, season's, league season's over. If we drew, well, uh, 
meh. Yeah, that's that's the three reactions here. What am I trying to repair, repair part of my finger? It's not gonna work, Davidoff. All right. This one's the hardest to open, that's for sure. It's a bit thick for the scissors. Ah! This damn cellar tape is secure. I can tell you that. Security-wise, good job. I must admit, even though they're annoying, to, even though they're annoying to open, it was well packaged. So I'm really impressed with the packaging. A lot of this, I guess, to keep it safe. More, more. Now, what is coming is Batman-related. That was the box, not 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 the object. It is a heat-changing mug. A mug, but a heat-changing mug. Batman style. This is the bat logo, you won't see it now, but when you pour hot water or any, any sort of hot, hot liquid inside, it will light up. So it will, it will basically tell you, indicate you how hot it is before you drink it. So if it's too hot, you will know, you know. It's pretty useful. So uh, let's go test it. And this time I'm taking off the tripod, okay? Shut up. Okay, I've taken it off now. You see, you see, there it is. Taking it off, I'm not lazy anymore, okay? Fip's sake, gotta take this pin off first. <sighs> Basically, I gotta put it on this, then put this on there. You know, it's a two-point system, I guess. That's and, and that's what I'm calling it. I don't know. If that, I don't. Know, I don't know if that's what it's actually called, but that's what I'm calling it. Okay, two Batman caps there. For some reason, the water's a bit dodgy, but. Uh, well, it's not working so far. Ain't it supposed to light up? Ain't, ain't it meant to light up? Um, it's hot. I, I, I can tell you, I can confirm it's hot. Um, I cannot see a light up. Now there is the light up there. It's lit up now. It's not that lit up though. It says like completely black is means it's cold. And very hot means that. So I guess it's not that hot, or maybe it's not working, maybe it's working properly and it's not that hot. But I swear it is, it is quite hot, but there, it does work. It does work. I guess this just means it's drinkable, I guess, in terms of like temperature. But yeah, it works. It works, that's all that matters. Need to test it more with tea and stuff, but um, yeah, it, it, it will work fine. Yes, lads, success. Now I got something to say. See all these options you have? Right, I chose these. Not gonna lie, I ordered these ones, but I'm not really that bothered that I got these because they're all worth the same. It's like there's no difference in price, so I'm not really going to like call them because they're a delivery company. So I'm not going to like call them up saying, "Oh, that's gonna take so much effort." So I'm just gonna leave it. Um, but yeah, I ordered those and got these. I don't really care as long as these are comfortable, which they are. Which is all I needed, so yeah. They just need to be ironed a bit, because uh, <laughs> they're a bit messy. But yeah, um, they do fit, that's the main thing. The gloves fit too, the slippers are comfortable, and the mug works. So, I'm impressed. Um, not much vent from this, the mug was like a fiver, because of my voucher. The slippers were quite cheap as well, because I had another voucher. And for that, well, got one teacher for a fiver, which is the main offer. I'll be vlogging daily in July when I go to Dubai. I'll be in Dubai for eight days and I will vlog every single day. So you can enjoy that. And when I get back from Dubai, I'll be going to the cinema to see War for the Planet of the Apes with my granddad. So it'll be daily vlogging for more than just eight days, which you will enjoy. I might start vlogging a few days before that as well. A few days before the holiday as well. Just get into the mode of daily vlogging. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. I hope you enjoyed this vlog. This was your boy Davidoff. Please like, share, subscribe. Um, that was my auntie. She was asking where my mum was, where my granddad was, where my grandma was. Well, they're not here. So uh, anyway, um, hope you enjoyed this vlog. There's more. There's more content coming soon. Of course, I upload daily anyway, so there'll be at least one thing uploaded every day. So subscribe. Come back. This was your boy Davidoff. Please like, share, subscribe. Thanks for watching. Have a good day and. See ya. Life is good right now. Take your mind out the gutter.